Hey guys, it's Rachel from The Little Ring Lamb. I filmed an introduction, but it was quite long and really unnecessary because this video is going to be very long. This is my bookshelf tour 2015. I have three bookshelves, and before this video starts, I just want to say disclaimer that I'm not trying to brag. This is just a requested video. Um, basically, I'm going to try to be not very shaky with the camera, but if it's a little shaky, I apologize. And without further ado, let's get to the book. So after I finish showing you guys um, my individual shelves, I'll do an overview of the whole thing, but this is the first shelf shelf of this bookcase and this is my new one um well it's well, new to me um and this is just an overview of the shelf it's you know a little tilted but you know still good so we start off with the princess diaries series i just stacked them horizontally because to save space um so we had the princess diaries collection princess in the spotlight princess in love princess in waiting and then right there we have project princess princess in pink Princess in Training, The Princess Present, Party Princess, Sweet Sixteen Princess, Valentine Princess, Princess on the Brink, Princess Mia, Forever Princess, and Royal Wedding, and that's all by Meg Cabot. And then we move over here and we have my Sabrina the Teenage Witch books. Um, I have the first one, uh, which is just Sabrina the Teenage Witch, Showdown at the Mall, Good Switch, Bad Switch, Been There, Done That, All You Need is a Love Spell, Salem on Trial, A Dog's Life, Lots of Luck, Spying Eyes, Harvest Moon, Now You See Her, Now You Don't, Prisoner Cabin 13, All That Glitters, Go Fetch, While the Cat's Away, Up Up and Away, Mummy Dearest, Eight Spells a Week, I'll, sa I'll Zap Manhattan, sorry, um, Shamrock Shenanigans, Age of Aquarius, and Bridal Bedlam, Reality Check, Milady's Dragon, and Sabrina Down Under. And now we go to the shelf, um, well not shelf, uh, sack next to it. And we have two Salem Tales books, and it's Salem Goes to Rome and Cat TV. And then up above, I have Ten Little Witches, which is a Sabrina the Teenage Witch book, a special edition one. Then my Beverly Hills 90210 books, I have two copies of Fantasies, Which Way to the Beach, Tis the Season, and Two Hearts. And also I have the stars of Beverly Hills 90210, Their Lives and Their Loves by Randy Reisfeld. And then I have Zack Strikes Back, which is a Saved by the Bell book, and it's by Beth Cruz. Then moving beside it, I have my Downton Abbey, um, the Complete Script Series 1 by Julian Fellows, Jurassic Park and Philosophy, Veronica Mars and Philosophy, and X vs. Y by Eve Epstein and Lenora Epstein. So this is an overview of that shelf. Try to back up a bit. Okay, so now we're moving down to the second shelf. So here's an overview of this shelf. It has some of my knickknacks on it or just stuff. So we have the number four and the power six, both by Pitticus Lore, Wake and Lullaby by Amanda Hawking, The Maze Runner, The Scorch Trials, and The Death Cure by James Dashner, my hairbrush, <laughs> um, because my mirror is like right beside this, so I always set it there, um, Origin by Jessica Kahuri, The Forsaken by Lisa M. Stasier, Eve by Anna Carey, 13 Reasons Why by Jay Asher, as well as The Future of Us by Jay Asher and Carolyn Mackler. 10 by Gretchen McNeil. Tiger Lily by Jody Lynn Anderson. Beautiful Creatures, Beautiful Darkness, Beautiful Chaos, and Beautiful Reduction, Redemption. All by Cami Garcia and Margaret Stoll. Um, Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children by Ransom Riggs. And you can't see it very well. Let me just move this out of the way. Of Poseidon by Anna Banks, and these are my little calico critters. Their ladder just fell. But this is this shelf. Now moving down to the third shelf. And this is the third shelf. Okay. So first we start off with my Sarah Dessen book. So we have That Summer, Someone Like You, Dreamland, Just Listen, Lock and Key, Along for the Ride, and The Moon and More, all by Sarah Dessen once again. Um, Me and Earl and the Dying Girl by Jesse Andrews. X and the Single Girl by Lonnie Diane Rich. 13 Little Blue Envelopes by Maureen Johnson. Withering Tights by Louise Renaissance. Etiquette and Espionage by Gail Carter. Um, Lucid by Adrian Stoltz and Ron Bass. The Shoemaker's Wife by Adriana Trigani. Six Months Later by Natalie D. Richards. The Clearing by Heather Davis. Matched and Crossed Both by Ali Condi. Shades of Grey by Jasper Ford. Beauty Queens by Libba Bray. It Started with a Dare by Lindsay Faith Wretch. Two Way Street by Lauren Barnholt. Belonging by Karen Ann Hopkins. 
The Perks of Being a Wallflower by Stephen Chbosky. And this is this shelf. Sorry, it's not focusing. Okay, there we go. Now down to the fourth shelf. So we have up above, we have I Love You, Beth Cooper by Larry Doyle. Then we have my books by Jessica Brody. We have The Karma Club, My Life Undecided, and 52 Reasons to Hate My Father. Rockaholic by C.J. Scoos. Something Real by Heather Demetrios. Mystic City by Theo Lawrence. Firecracker by David Iserson. And then we have the two um, Carrie Diaries books. So The Carrie Diaries and Summer in the City by Candace Bushnell. Amy and Roger's Epic Detour by Morgan Matson, Trapped by Michael Northrup. Julia and Mortal by Stacey Gray. Christmas in the Snow by Karen Swan. Dash and Lily's Book of Dares by Rachel Cohn and David Levithan. Privilege by Zoe Dean. Then I have Burn for Burn and Fire of Fire by Jenny Hahn. And I always mess up her first name and I always forget to say it, but it's S-I-O-B-H-A-N, Vivian. Um, to All the Boys I've Loved Before by Jenny Hahn. Um, Jody Picoult and Samantha Van Leer's Between the Lines. Defy by Sarah B. Larson. My Sister's Keeper by Jody Picoult. Spies and Prejudice by Talia Vance. So this is that shelf, the fourth shelf. Moving down to the last shelf on this bookshelf, which has a lot of darker books because I tried to like put them with the right colors so they didn't look like there was all these dark books on one side and all light books on another. So down here we have House of Leaves by Mark Z. Danielensky, Bridget Jones' Diary by Helen Fielding, a hundred, The Hundred-Year-Old Man with who climbed out the window and disappeared by Jonas Jonasson. The Anatomy of Wings by Karen Foxley. Losers in Space by John Barnes. The Girl with the Steel Corset by Katie Cross. Um, the Mrs. Marriage Project. Sorry, I'm trying to read this off my camera. By Pauline Fisk. Spirit Bound, a Vampire Academy novel by Rochelle Mead. The Broken Hearted by Amelia Kahani. The Darkest Minds by Alexandria Bracken. Shatter Me by Tahara Mafi. Anna Dressed in Blood by Kendar Blake, All These Things I've Done, and Because It's My Blood by Gabrielle Zevin, uh, Such a Rush by Jennifer Eccles, um, These Are My Books by Katie McGarry, I Have Pushing the Limits, Dare You To, Crash Into You, and Take Me On, Flipped by Wendelin Van Draken, A Beautiful Evil by Kelly this Keaton. Overview. This is an overview of this shelf. Sorry, it's a little dark because this is the last shelf and there's not much light over in this corner of my room. Oh, and we also have Pride's Castle, um, Yearby. I don't know the there's no dust jacket on that but here I'm just gonna do a giant overview of the shelf let me just back up here so this is just shelf it will focus and I have my to the art of toy story book on top and some lego figurines so this is the complete shelf and that's bookshelf number one so this is my second bookshelf so this is the top it just has some random books up there and then this is the first shelf so we start off the line game series by sarah shepherd which includes the line game never have i ever two truths and a lie hide and seek cross my heart and hope to die and seven minutes in heaven then i have this um, lunar chronicles um some of the books in there by marissa meyer i have cinder scarlet and cress don't look back by jennifer armantrout Reconstructing Amelia by Kimberly McCrate. Wentworth Hall by Abby Graham. The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer and the Evolution of Mara Dyer by Michelle Hodkin. Um, Jillian Flynn's books, Sharp Objects, Dark Places, and Gone Girl. Forgive Me Leonard Peacock by Matthew Quick. 172 Hours on the Moon by Johan Harstead. Legend by Marie Lu. And The Spectacular Now by Tim Tharp. And some of the books jut out more because I might have some notes on them and I don't want the sticky tabs to hit the wall. So some of them look jutted out. This is my second shelf and by far one of my favorites. So we start off with the Priya Liars series, which includes Priya Liars, Flawless, Perfect, Unbelievable, Wicked, Killer, Heartless, Wanted, Twisted, Ruthless, Stunning, Burned, Crushed, Deadly, Toxic, Vicious, and then I put the prequels on the end, which are pre Pretty Little Secrets, and Allie's Pretty Little Lies. Then I have the Perfectionist Duology, which includes the Perfectionist and the Good Girls. Then I have the Heiresses, and these are all by Sarah Shepard. Um, How to Love by Katie Catugno, and The Beginning of Everything by Robin Schneider. 
So that's the second shelf. I'm moving down to the third shelf, which is another one of my favorites. As you can see, there's my little Lego figurines. So starting off on the side, I have David Copperfield by Charles Dickens. I have a gap there because I'm not sure what I want to put there. Then I have my Outlander series, and I just stack them horizontally. So you have Outlander, Dragonfly and Amber, the third book's on the top because I'm currently reading it, so Voyager, Drums of Autumn, The Fiery Cross, and A Breath of Snow and Ashes. Um, and then we move on to The Marriage Plot by Jeffrey Eugenides, Crazy Rich Asians by Kevin Kwan, um, two Veronica Mars books, um, The Thousand Dollar Tan Line, and Mr. Kiss and Tell by Rob Thomas with Jennifer Graham. Dying to Know You by Aiden Chambers. Then I have some Colleen Hoover books. I have Ugly Love, Maybe Someday, Slammed, Point of a Tree, This Girl, Hopeless, and Losing Hope. Then I have The Rosie Project and The Rosie Effect by Graham Seamsian. And lastly, I have Colorless, Tuzukuri Tazaki and His Years of Pilgrimage by Haruki Murakami. Um, and this is the third shelf. This is the fourth shelf. So to start off here, they're blocking. These are my Elon Hildebrand books. I just put the little ones um, in front to save room. So I have The Island, Barefoot, The Blue Bistro, Nantucket Nights, and The Beach Club. And then I'm going to move these out of the way. Then I have The Castaways, Silver Girl, Summerland, Beautiful Day, The Matchmaker, and Winter Street. Put those back there. Then I have The Attachments, Eleanor Park, Fangirl, and Landline, all by Rainbow Rowell. Stolen by Lucy Christopher. Um, the Summer I Turn Pretty trilogy, which includes The Summer I Turn Pretty, It's Not Summer Without You, and We'll Always Have Summer by Jenny Hahn. My Life Next Door by Huntley Fitzpatrick. Um, if I Stay and Where She Went by Gail Foreman. Anne and the French Kiss, Lola and the Boy Next Door, and Isla and the Happily Ever After, all by Stephanie Perkins. A Man Called Ove by Frederick Bachman. And We Were Liars by E. Lockhart. So this is the fourth shelf. Down to the last shelf, which is very packed but I have books behind this stack and then these books. So I'm going to start Gossip Girl books. So I have Gossip Girl, You Know You Love Me, All I Want Is Everything, Because I'm Worth It, I Like It Like That, You're the One That I Want, Would I Lie to You, Nothing Can Keep Us Together, Nobody Does It Better, Only In Your Dreams, Don't You Forget About Me, It Had To Be You, and I Will Always Love You. And these are all by Cecilia Von Zygasar. And then if we push this out of the way, this is what lies behind it. And it's the It Girl series also by Cecilia Von Zygasar. So I have the It Girl, Notorious, Reckless, Unforgettable, Lucky, Tempted, Infamous, Adored, Devious, Classic. And then I have two books out of her Gossip Girl, the Carlisle series. Um, the first book, the Carlisles, and the second book, which is kind of dark down here um, in the shelf. But it's You Just Can't Get Enough, and it's the second book in the series. And that was behind the big Gossip Girl column. Then I have Divergent, Insurgent, and Allegiant by Veronica Roth. And the selection series by Kira Cass, which includes the selection, the elite, the one, and the air. You know this whole shelf? Now on to the third. This is the third shelf. This shelf hasn't this bookshelf hasn't changed as much as my other bookshelves because I really like this design. But this is what's on top. It's just my book columns. Uh, Mr. Selfridge, my Downton Abbey DVDs, and another book column and some decals. And then we go down to this shelf, and this is just the iPod headphone thing and like a little Lego thing. If you watch my um, Top 5 Wednesday about my bookshelf, you will know all that stuff. Here's an overview of this shelf, though. So go back over here. We have Northanger Abbey and Other Works by Jane Austen, Othello by Shakespeare, um, Balzac and the Little Chinese Seamstress by Dai uh, C.G. I probably pronounced that horribly wrong. July's People by Nadine Gordemere. Flowers of Evil and Other Works by Baudelaire. The Importance of Being Earnest and Other Plays by Oscar Wilde. Generals Die in Bed by Charles Yale Harrison. Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen. How Proust Can Change Your Life by Elaine de Balton. Endgame and Act Without Words by Samuel, Samuel Beckett. The Homecoming by Harold Pinter. Pride and Prejudice by Jane Austen, and A Room for View by E.M. Forrester. Then we move over to the second column. I'm just going to move that out of the way. Um, we have Dr. Doolittle Zoo by Hugh Lofting, Clee Wick by Emily Carr, Icy Sparks by Gwyn Hyman Rubio, Blackjack by Leon Garfield, 1984 by George Orwell, Mark Twain's The Adventures of Tom Sawyer and The Adventures of Huckleberry Finn, Joy Kagawa's Obasan, Frankenstein by Mary Shelley, Withering Heights by Charlotte Bronte, 
The Mouse Trap and Other Plays by Agatha Christie, Animal Farm by George Orwell, and Oliver Twist by Charles Dickens. Then we move to the side where we have Jaws 1 by Peter Benchley and Jaws 2 by Hank Searles. Um, the Jurassic Park duology, Jurassic Park and the Lost World by Michael Crichton, Airframe by Michael Crichton, Cleopatra's Daughter by Michelle Moran, um, Philippa Gregory's The White Queen and the Red Queen, and then I have a few Rodal books, which include The BFG, George's Marvelous Medicine, The Twits, then I have The Mysterious Benedict Society by Trenton Lee Stewart, Charlotte's Web by E.B. White, and The Knife of Never Letting Go by Patrick Ness. So this is the shelf. I tried to make it really red and white over here so it kind of matches. And these are my like classics and school books right in front of you. Now moving on to my second shelf. So this is my second shelf. Now we're going to go back over here. So I have Althea and Oliver by Christine Morocco. Um, Lauren De Stefano's Wither, Fever, and Sever, as well as The Perfect Ruin. Um, the Luke series um, by Anna Goberson, which include The Lukes, Rumors, Envy, and Splendor. I used to get rid of dust jackets, so that's why Envy does not have a dust jacket. Um, when I was really young, it was a foolish decision. Um, but I hated them so much. Um, then I have their, her other series, the Bright Young Things series, um, which is Bright Young Things, Beautiful Days, and The Lucky Ones by Anna Goberson. Remember Me by Christopher Pike. Shopping Seduction, Mr. Selfridge by Lindy Woodhead. Lady Catherine and the Real Downton Abbey um, by the Countess of Carnav Carnarvon. I probably pronounced that horribly wrong. Um, Multiple Blessings by John and Kate Gosselin and Beth Carson. Um, Stories from Candyland by Candy Spelling. Storytelling, Mommy Wood, Uncharted Territory, and Spelling It Like It Is by Tori Spelling. Jason Priestley, A Memoir. Um... Deep Thoughts from a Hollywood Blonde by Jenny Garth, Melissa Explains It All by Melissa Joan Hart, and Jim Henson, The Biography by Brian J. Jones. So this is an overview of the second shelf. Now going down to the third shelf. First we start off with the Sister of the Traveling Pants series. So the Sister of the Traveling Pants, um, The Second Summer of the Sisterhood, Girls in Pants, Forever in Blue, and Sisterhood Everlasting, all by Amber Shares. Then on my Shopaholic books, well, first off, I have Room by Emma Donahue on top. Then I have the Shopaholic books, Confessions of a Shopaholic, Shopaholic Takes Manhattan, Shopaholic Ties the Knot, Shopaholic and Sister, Shopaholic and Baby, Mini Shopaholic, Shopaholic to the Stars, Remember Me, The Undomestic Goddess, Twenties Girl, Can You Keep a Secret, I've Got Your Number, and Wedding Night, and those are all by Sophie Kinsella. And then I have my Confessions of Georgia Nicholson series books. Um, I'm missing the second book. I cannot find it anywhere. I need to repurchase that, but I haven't found um, a good deal on the covers I want. I can only find it in the covers. I Like, I want them all matching again. So anyway, I have the first book, Angus Fongs of Full Frontal Snogging. Knocked Out by My Nunga Nunga is the third book. Fourth, Dancing in My Nudie Pants. Fifth, Away Laughing on a Fast Camel. Sixth, Then He Ate My Boy in Trancers. Seven, Startled by His Furry Shorts. Eight, Love is a Many Trousered Thing and nine stop in the name of pants, and ten are these my basumas I see before me all by Louise Renaissance. So that is an overview of the third shelf. So this is the fourth shelf. Usually, usually there's a big thing like on the wall here, um, but I had to move it so I could show you guys much better and not be showing you guys on a bad angle, the bookshelf. So this one's just like random books. Um, so Throw in a Glass by Sarah J Moss, Before I Go to Sleep by S.J. Watson, um, Ruby Red, Sapphire Blue, and Emerald Green by Kirsten Gear, Perfect Chemistry and Chain Reaction by Simone Alcalez, Jenny Danum's You Against Me and Before I Die, Truly Madly Deadly by Hannah Jane, um, The Hunger Games, Catching Fire and Mockingjay by Suzanne Collins, The Fault in Our Stars and right in between there is Looking for Alaska, and Paper Towns all by John Green, Door Who Must Die by Danielle Page, Marley Me by John Grogan, Delirium by Lauren Oliver, um, I Am the Messenger by Marcus Zusak, Half Brother by Kenneth Opal, Victoria and the Rogue by Meg Cabot, The Notebook, Dear John, Safe Haven, and A Walk to Remember All by Nicholas Sparks, and The Devil Wears Prada and Revenge Wears Prada by Lauren Weisberger. So that is the fourth shelf. Down to the final shelf of all my book, well, this bookshelf and the final shelf in total. And this is the final shelf.
Okay, so we're going to start from the beginning. So Mouse and Abbey right here on the side of the very thin book and the missing diamond. And this is by Joanna Bicknell and Nick Page. Sorry, it's very hard to read from in between my... It's very hard to read my camera finder. The Book of Negroes by Lawrence Hill. Audrey Waite by Robin Benway. I'm a genius of unspeakable evil and I want to be your class president by Josh Lieb. Um, Under the Dome by Stephen King. The Ivy by Lauren Kuntz and Rena Oner. So Super Stylish by Rose Wilkins. Samantha Smythe's Modern Family Journal by Lucy Cavendish. The Predicts by Christine Seferit. Violet on the Runway by Melissa Walker. Zombies and Unicorns, Black vs. Larbluster. I probably pronounced that horribly wrong. I'm sorry again. The Nanny Diaries and Nanny Returns by Emma McLaughlin and Nicola Krause. The History of the World According to Facebook by Wiley Overstreet. Precious by Sapphire, um, The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo, The Girl Who Played a Fire, and The Girl Who Kicked the Hornet's Nest by Stieg Larsson. Top 8, What's Your Status and Unfriended by Katie Finn. Heart to Heart by Lurleen McDaniel. Poser and The Good, The Fab, and The Ugly by Rachel Maud. The Chosen One by Carol Lynch Williams. Sweet 16 by Kate Bryan. Kissed by an Angel by Elizabeth Chandler. And Everlast by Elizabeth Chandler as well. So this is the last shelf in the bookcase. I'm going to give you a quick overview of the whole bookcase. Start on top. Okay, so that is my whole bookshelf tour. Sorry if that was a little long, guys. I went as fast as I could. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I want to thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!